David Hilbert can be considered as one of the most influential mathematicians uh, in the 19th and the 20th century. Some of his works include Invariant Theory, Calculus of Variations, Ideas Behind the Hilbert Space and also the 23 Problems. He proposed in 1900 in the International Congress of Mathematics. Some of the problems got solved, some got partially solved, some were proved to be unprovable and some aren't proved yet. But it was a century later something else was discovered by a German historian and mathematician. Hilbert's 24th problem in the year 2000. The problem was not officially stated in his list of problems but was found in his notes and we will now try to understand the problem. This is a small piece of the actual article, you can find it uh, in the description below, where he says that David Hilbert actually tried to convey that the main idea of the problem was based on the theory of method of proofs in mathematics. He said that every theorem with some given conditions had a simplest proof. To understand it more, he gave a general idea. Suppose there exists a theorem which can be proved in two ways. He then told that either of the proofs can be derived from each other. He told not to take either paths of proving a theorem or search for a third path, but try to understand what's the relation between the two paths. Now I have decided something interesting. Comment below if you want me to make videos on all the 23 problems given by David Hilbert. So basically this was the general overview of the 24th problem given by David Hilbert and comment below if you want me to make videos on all the 23 problems.